Okay, today we're going to solve some problems using skip counting. And one of the problems that you might have is counting all your pocket money. And so here I've got $2 coins. So each one of these coins is worth $2. And I'd like to count how many coins or how much money I have in total all together if I add it all up. So to do that, we're going to use skip counting. We're going to skip count in twos. Now, as I drag my coins down towards my piggy bank, I'll just put them down the bottom here. But as I drag them down, we're going to count in twos. And you can count along with me. Here we go. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30, 32, 34, 36, 38, 40. So, I have $40. Alright. Now this time, we're going to be skip counting in fives, that's right, because these are five dollar notes, and each one of those notes is worth five dollars. So let's see how much money I've got. Count along with me. Here we go. Five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-two, twenty-five, thirty, thirty-five, forty. 45, 50, 55. So that's $55 in total. So let's see if we can count this money. Have a look at the notes. You can see the number 10 on there. Each one of those notes is worth $10. So we're going to be skip counting in tens. Let's see if we can work out how much money I've got on this page. Here we go. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70. That's 70 dollars. Okay, now it's time for you to do some on your own. This time, as I grab each of these marbles, you can see I'm taking two at a time, so we're going to be skip counting in two for this job, and I'm going to put them in this box. And as I'm putting them in there, I'd like you to skip count in twos. And at the end of it, you should be able to tell me how many marbles I've put into the box. So count along in your head or with a small voice, and at the end, see if it's the number that I get. Here we go, counting on your own. Alright, should have a number in your head. Was it 24 marbles? That's how many marbles we had. 24. Let's try another. Okay, on this one, we've got a little clock. Now, you can see that there are some really thick lines, and then there's some really thin lines here. Now each one of those really thin lines is one minute. Alright, so let's have a look. If I start here, I've got one, two, three, four, and five. So that means that every one of these big thick lines is five minutes. So if I count those, that's skip counting in fives. Alright, so as I move the minute hand around, like this, you're going to skip count for me in five. Like that. Okay? Alright, here we go. Now, let's see if you get how many minutes I've moved the hand. Same as me. Counting along. Starting at zero.
All right, how many minutes do we have there? 25 minutes is what I got, and I hope you got the same. 25 minutes. All right, once again, it's time to challenge ourselves. Now, in this one, I already have $3 in my pocket or in my piggy bank. So when we count on with our fives, we're not going to be starting at zero. I've already got $3, so I'm going to be starting at $3 and counting on in fives. All right, so just have a think about that. What would the next number be after three if I'm counting on five more? All right, so I'll give you a clue. The next number after three will be eight. Now let's see if you can remember some of those patterns we've talked about before in other lessons and see if you can pick up the pattern really early. Let's go. We're starting at three. Okay, how much did you get? I got $43. So I hope you went okay with that. If you didn't, go back, have another go at it, and hopefully you'll go well with that one. Okay, we'll have a look at this one now. We've got a bunch of lollies, and we're going to do this one in twos. But for an extra challenge here, we're not going to count up, we're going to count down. Okay, so this time we're taking lollies away and putting them in this blue box and I want you to count how many are left after I count down in two. So we're going to be starting at 27 and counting down from there. Here we go. All right, how many are left there now? What was the number that you're up to? 15 lollies should be left. And we could check that. Here's two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, and one more makes 15. All right, again, if you didn't do too well on that one, go back and have a practice of it again. If you did really well, fantastic, good job and that's awesome so that's the end of this lesson i hope you did well